Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Ember with me, Bring It Dawn. Uh, so I did some crafting off camera, which by the way, I do really enjoy the crafting in this game. Also the aesthetics. I crafted a helmet, a level 13 helmet for both uh, my main character and Corrin. As well as armor for both my main character and Corrin. And I also crafted my main character a new weapon, a sturdy infused steel rune blade of desperation. So I think the rune blade looks really cool and sounds really cool. I'm normally a two-handed hammer kind of guy. I didn't craft anything for Xanon because we ran out of coal. Well, I take the merchants ran out of coal. There's only so much uh, coal going around, it seems. I couldn't find any more. In case you're wondering where we're at, uh, here's the market. We're just up here on this little dead end. We're going to continue to explore the City of Pinnacle, looking for all of their dark secrets before we go and talk to their king. I thought there were... Hmm. Oh, nothing. What a waste. Also, I did find uh, the unique items that the merchants sell, and I will be striving to get those. Uh, but now, we don't have a stun, by the way. Our upgraded equipment uh, did not... We should catch them unawares. ...not reward us with a stun. All of you live if you run! <laughs> I do have a uh, desperate strike though, which I think is the lower my health is, the more damage I do. He has Dispel, Whirling Blades, I have Healing Burst, and Flash Strike. But she's the same, so. Do you think that will happen a lot? Yeah, probably. Yeah, I enjoy the crafting system in this game. It's not like overly complicated and uh, it's just it's easy to manage. Some games I feel like overcomplicate the crafting. Or make it too grindy. There is a chest right here, and I want it. Alright, fine. You win this time, chest. But next time. Your booty's mine. The end is near. Yeah, we've read that. Anoki? Yeah? If I was you, I would be bothering my wife, Ola. Is that a threat? No, it's a warning. She'll talk your ear off about her crackpot Prince Syrian theories. What kind of theories are those? Crackpot ones. I just told you. You want to hear them? Go ask her. Just don't let the wrong person hear you listening. Is she upstairs? Ola. Oh, I know you. Such a beautiful day, is it not? That it is. Days like this feel rarer and rarer lately. And why is that? Well, you know the old saying, a city is only as healthy as its king. Uh, do you know what is wrong with the king? How would I know? Do I look like a healer? All I know is his son doesn't seem too upset about it. And why do you say that? Just look at him, holding all these secret celebrations, consorting with mages, and probably doing even worse. You think a boy with a father like his would have been turned out, would have turned out better? Never can tell when, it, uh, when you'll lay a bad egg. Reminds me of my boy Marcus. Well, what's wrong with Marcus? Oh, what isn't wrong with that fool of a son? Pouring and drinking and fighting and stealing. What I wouldn't give to beat that boy within an inch of his life. Show him his foolish ways. 
Point is, men like Marcus and Syrian learn the hard way. The party won't last forever. Yep, the party will not last forever. That is for sure. Plate mail of the quake. Can be sold for money. Is there anything actually over here? So, merchant. A grocer. Grocer. How can we help you to that? Hey. Yeah, sorry. Stocking up on money again. I spent quite a bit. Has it like 10,000 gold? The unique items in the city cost 19,000. Okay, I will take that recipe and I will learn it. Fine silver war bow. Sounds really cool. We're gonna continue south. Avoid the palace for now. Also, the last plate, the uh, last postmaster quest is here, which I've forgotten entirely about. Hey, the sun. What? Are you human? You me. No. Why? Then what are you doing here? This is Pinnacle, the birthplace of humanity. It's not a place for non-humans. You keep wandering around here, and you'll find out why. Is that a threat? It's a promise. Well, I'll go where I choose and do as I please. Quite the ego you have. When someone kills you, don't come crying to me. Make it fast, whatever it is. Welcome. How are you liking Pinnacle? It is unique, though surprisingly unfriendly. Yes, I'm afraid we have a bit of an isolationist, even xenophobic streak running through a segment of our populace. It can be traced back to our first king, Magnus, and his occasionally icy relations with other cultures. But the true ancestor of antagonism is King Gormir, whose power-hungry nature fractured Pinnacle from the rest of Domus for many centuries. Uh, you seem quite knowledgeable in Pinnacle lore. It's become a hobby of mine. I've been reading Gerald Wembley's excellent series on our city. Let me tell you, Pinnacle has been the center of a great many power grabs. Some more recent than Gormir's, though it's best not to speak of such things. Well, thanks for the reference. I'm a bit of a history buff myself. Perhaps I'll keep an eye out for these books. Anytime. Hope you enjoy them as much as I did. And we've... We've seen uh, Wembley's writings before. Alright, this guy sells runes and necklaces. It might not. It's so expensive, man. Hmm, this is interesting. I would like. I don't actually know what each... I'm assuming this would go on a weapon. So it's red for weapon. Green for armor. Blue for helmet. No, this is... Oh, no, this is for uh, bows, it looks like. I would like to have... This is for staves. I could do head bash. So I think that we need we need some sort of CC. Uh, 
double strike will go to my weapon. And corn will get head bash. For right now. Hold there, Lowlander. Nobody allowed beyond this point. Uh, what is down there? The Bastille. The biggest and best prison on all of Domus. For your safety, I suggest you turn around and head back to town. Alright, so we can't go that way yet. Alright, let's go talk to the king. We're there. Now we have some sort of crowd control. That's important. It's really good for comboing. You can combo any two abilities together, but uh, I always feel as though a stun is the way to go. Especially head bash. It stuns for four seconds. I think is the longest stun. I remember what shoulder bash <clears throat> uh, stun for. You more like that, have a drink. Your weak defenses make my arm hurt. <laughs> Out of here. All right, uh, let's rest up real quick. That is a sextant, not what I wanted to use. Taylor. Are you looking for anything in Not particularly, no. I'm not looking for anything. Moth robes, also level 17. The folds of these robes are filled with tiny glowing moths. Yeah, that's how much all the unique items cost in this town. Particular. Or city. I think the one guy is actually below. Or not, because it doesn't seem as though you can get in from below. You want some more? The Toad of the Maid. You a man on today? Is there something I could do for you? I'm looking for the king. He's resting in his chambers upstairs. You can find the stairway just outside this room. Oi, you scared me! Alright, we'll have a letter addressed to you. Oh gosh, thank you. I'm expecting news of a possible chambermaid opening in the City of Light Council building. Taking care of King Xavier is fine work, but it's not pay well. Are you gonna cry now? King Xavier. If yes, what do you want from me? I'm sorry for disturbing you, your majesty. Did you promise a white ember to the necromancer in the Bog of Souls? Who? Ah, wait. You mean the demented old mage in the middle of the swamp? No, I most certainly did not. Now wait. My son, Syrian, he might know about it. He knows the mages, and he's been smuggling a lot of embers into the city. Gets them from Victus. My younger brother. Why? Is Victus here? He owes me a coin for the porridge. Uh, tell me more about your son, Syrian. My only son, sweet little Syrian. We used to be so close, but he's all grown up now. He doesn't like to spend time with me. It's not his fault. I'm old and sick. Not very good company for anyone anymore. Uh, why would King Victus violate your ban? That wasn't my ban. That was my father's idea. Ferrothul. Uh, he started it 50 years ago. I kept it going. I thought it made sense. But it didn't, did it? I was wrong. So I let them bring a few in. Just here and there. Can that be our secret? 
Shh. I'll never tell. Uh, why did King Barathil enact the ban in the first place? Oh, that was a long time ago. I remember it very clearly. The Mage's Guild had been using embers to breed creatures. Monstrosities that they couldn't control. My father wouldn't shut down the guild. I think he didn't want a lot of angry mages after him. I don't blame him. But with the ban, they couldn't get their hands on embers. At least, that was the idea. But if you're allowing the smuggling now, can't the mages guild simply go back to their old ways? Why did I allow the smuggling? Wait, why did I allow the smuggling? Oh, that's right. All the poverty. All the people starving. I hope Syrian would use the embers to make things better. On the sly, you know. But, I guess he's not. Why would Prince Syrian trade a white ember to the necromancer? What did he get in return? Wait, just a minute. Now you're saying Syrian traded a white ember to the necromancer? Why would that be? Maybe to find a cure? Syrian said he was finding a cure for me. That's probably it. He'll be here any minute. Well, thank you. I think I should speak with Prince Syrian. Wait, now that I'm thinking clearly, didn't he say he was going on some sort of expedition with the Mages Guild? I think so. Yes, I think so. You have to wait. He could be gone a long time. Uh, can you think of anything that would bring Syrian back here in a hurry? Uh, Syrian would be very, very upset if people were to find out about all that smuggling he's been doing with mages. He would come back to clear his name. Thanks to be known for his honesty. Shh. He's not all that honest, but it's still very important to him. Uh, what kind of evidence would prove that he's been smuggling? Who's been smuggling? Oh wait, Syrian. Yes. Evidence that Syrian has been smuggling embers. Just wait a minute. Alright. Okay. Now the ember smuggling, it all moves through the Mages Guild, in the Bastille, the prison. There's a ledger. They write it all down. They have to. The comings and goings. That could be trouble for Syrian and Victus, if it ever got out. I'm sure you're right. I'll find it. Good, good. You find it, and I'll hide it so nobody gets in trouble. Now, let me think. The entrance to the Bastille is in the southern part of the city. If a guard stops you, just say 50 waterfalls. That's the password, I think. Okay, well, let's hope that gets us in. Poor old man is losing his mind. And his son is taking advantage of the situation. So I put a shoddy fence behind this building and I can't circle around it. It's literally just spikes in the ground. Make it fast, whatever it is. Alright, King Xavier has asked me to go to the Bastille. He said to tell you 50 waterfalls. Oh, well that's the King's Code. I can't imagine anyone wanting to go into that place, but you may pass. Well, thank you. It is my job after all. Ensure the safety of Domus. And these raw fish. Uh-oh. So like we're off to a good start. What could await us in the Bastille? Lots of dead zombie. Empty bucket. Glad I found that. Oh, 
That looks like it. Gods, this is exhausting. Out of that one alive. Oh, so they have mages behind it. In case that was not abundantly clear. I really like the barrels that have a bunch of treasure in them. Not these, uh, not these food barrels. Fine silver rods, pure great helm. Let's rest up. You shall perish at my hand. Come on, foreign, go this way. So it looks as though the Bastille has been overrun by uh, zombies, by the way. Don't know if y'all can tell. This isn't so hard. Do you do this all the time, Lightbringer? Yeah, and you've been doing it with me for, I don't know, a handful of episodes. We're in the same boat, Xanon. That's right, we had the quest for the uh, Mage's Guild person. Is it in here that I use it? Yeah, there it is. 51. Hot dog. I have lockpicks in here. Elven Robe of Explosion. A bunch of treasure. An opal. Well, I'm glad I came down here. I knew there were mages in one of the dead ends that I needed to get. And I found them. I killed three of eleven. I'm pretty sure the rest of them are all inside the Bastille. Not all of them, but some of them. coin purse. That's super disappointing. Treasure? Yep.
Yeah, some crafting materials. Do some potions. Those are handy. Enter the Bastille. This might be a challenge. Intruder. No. -uh. Another mage down. Uh, too easy. It is too easy. I'm gonna check inside all these cells, make sure there's no treasure. Your blood shall stain the earth. Yeah, is it, is it my blood staining the earth? Talk big. Oh wow, they are immediately on top of me. My train is paying off. I can't cast a spell to get rid of the silence. Of course. Shall we pause while you cry? Maybe I know that after all. I never thought Monkwood would be this bloody. That guy was a doozy. Screw that guy. He was a greater mage, so it makes sense, but still, that guy was nasty. It was mostly that we had to deal with all of his, uh, Adds before we could fight him. Give me strength. Well, let's focus on this one, man. It's already outside of the uh, cage. Screaming in the background. Oh. <laughs> Take your best shot. This altercation shall not last long. Oh, was he like this? Sleep or something? All right. Your death is inevitable. Your weakness amuses me. My fury shall rain upon your foolish heads. Alright, Xanon, you gotta... Uh-oh. Gotta put it on out of that explosion if you can. Thank the goddess that's over. You can thank me instead. I'm the one controlling you guys. That's a pretty big deal. That's a way forward. It's the way forward, though. Turn back. Let's have a drink. Instead. No, Corin, go. Chase them down. What are you doing? Just hear my nutter say. Oh, that looks like it hurts. Yeah, cut them down real quick. All right, slaughtering these guys. I haven't felt this alive in years. Your head shall adorn my neck. Oh, it's a little blood loss between friends. These poor guys know? don't have a chance. Oh, 
chocolate trap door. You might need a healer after that one. That will leave a mark. Do you think that will happen a lot? We're not supposed to go down here yet. By the way. This comes later. I think. Regardless, we know it's here, so we won't leave the area until we've uh, explored inside of it. They really need a rest right there. Uh, but I think I want to finish clearing out this room, and then we'll probably call it an episode. Easy peasy. I shall need to sharpen my blade after that tussle. No. I have butterweed and stuff. Y'all are out of here. This is all worth 20. I don't get rid of these coin purses. They're not worth anything. I'm gonna hold on to that. Recipes that I may or may or may not already know. Didn't know one of them. Okay. Yay! I think we should avoid these. It shall be an honor to destroy you all. Let's get take care of this guy real quick. I both, but I did not. There's just a few more enemies over in this, uh, on the far side here. More of those atrocities. Um, let's go ahead and kill everybody up real quick. Send Corrin in. Who would stand against me? Weak defenses make my arm hurt. That was fun. Okay, well, I mean, the equipment's crude, it's not that big of a deal. Alright, and we'll call the episode here, and the next one we'll continue to explore, and we'll go and confront, uh, Or deal with the ember smuggling operation. Let's rest. Alright, the next episode we pick it up here. We continue battling our way through the Bastille. To uh, deal with the, yeah, the ember smuggling. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode.